to go through the um, control systems on a Gemini control unit. This is um, sitting beside its saltwater chlorinator here. And uh, this control unit actually has um, two plugs in the bottom. You see there, one for the pump, and SWC is for the saltwater chlorinator. Um, or that also can be for a chlorine feeder if it's um, feeding liquid chlorine. So this guy has um, the ORP reader to check the chlorine level, and it also has a pH probe on it to check the acid level. And there's an acid dosing pump down here, which it powers on and runs when it wants to dump acid, dose acid into the pool. And this is the chlorinator that it turns on when it wants to add chlorine to the pool. So rather than just having the chlorine come on on the time clock, uh, it actually measures the chlorine level and only runs the chlorinator uh, when it's wanting to add chlorine, so uh, stopping the chlorine level from going too high. So this here, your menu button is the enter button. Try and get that at an angle where you can see it well. You press enter and that's the timer menu. So to set the clock, which is what I want to do right now, um, you press enter and there's set time, so enter. Give the button a good press. Here we go, hours. You've got yes and no up and down to these bottom ones. So the hours, I actually want to go down. It is 10.41 uh, at the moment. So set it to, to there, then I'm gonna press enter. Uh, too slow. Timer menu, set time, hours, keep going. Minutes, here we go. 41 I said, didn't I? So we're gonna go with the up until we get to 41. The buttons aren't great. Pumping away on it here. Nice, I'm gonna take the 42 by now, here we go. So, time of menu, set time minutes, 10.42. So now we press enter. And that's obviously going to have your timers for how long it, it runs and filters. So let's get into that timer menu now. Okay, so how to adjust the timer on this um, chlorinator. And it is a tough one, I'll admit. I um, had to ask for help on this one because it wasn't making logical sense to me. But uh, we hit enter to go into the menu, timer menu. We hit enter again. Yeah, these buttons aren't great. Here we go, set time. Now we use these to go through. Adjust cycles, this is your time clock cycles. Enter. Adjust cycles one. I actually want to cycle, I want to adjust cycle two. Oh, it's changing the time. So, on at one off at 12, that's where it was, pressing enter again, adjust cycles 2, here it goes, it's on at 16.30, and off at 19, so now we can adjust it, I want to give it another hour, 19.30, can you read that, 19.45, there, 20, that's what I wanted, and then we press enter, okay, so she's back. So that's the tip there is when you go into the menu, the timer menu, you press it again, you get set time, but in order to get anything else, you have to then use your yes, no buttons, your up, down buttons. Uh, and you have to keep pressing them. Adjust cycles, light menu, there's a light power button underneath as well. You can probably automatically have it come in at night. Set time. So there you go, setting time, setting the time clock on a Gemini control.